assalamu alaikum welcome back to tech and talk this video is related to file uh, saving types how we can save the file in different types if you are don't know how to save your files in eight different types using adobe illustrator this video is for you so this video is completely related to file uh, type file saving type i don't uh, make any design inside in this video i only tell you about how you save all these eight types of file inside the adobe illustrator most of the people did not know how i save svg file even pdf file or if you are a autocad autocad designer then you can also save this file in autocad file type directly so then you directly open your file inside the autocad software and you can save the png and jpg file most of the people uh, are confused between uh, save as and export as i also clearly define and clearly show the steps of uh, save as and export as and the main difference between both of them this video is very important if you want to uh, if you want to make uh, if you want this type of videos then you can comment in the comment section so i make all new videos related to file type so without further delay let's start our video uh, first i i must tell you about uh, i divide this video in small parts so you can easily jump to each parts to watch uh, your related file type okay let's see this is the file i already make the file okay first is the ai uh, file format first is the ai file format so let's start simply go to file go to save as because i have already opened this file then i go to save as and there is already selected ai file format so i i make uh, the name of this file as 2020 poster design ai uh type theek hai okay i hope this will help then go to next this is file i already make a folder where i save my files okay now this dialog box open if you are using uh illustrator 2020 then this is the upper uh, top uh, top option shown on your menu bar dialog box i save my almost uh, i save my files in illustrator 10 because uh in this way this file can open in any version of illustrator even cc cs6 all files must open in that format okay hit okay then go to my file okay there is my file now you can see that the file is saved in ai format so next file type is eps type this file is now saved in ai format then i go to save a file save as next is the <coughs> eps format i simply change the name to eps type so you can see what is the difference so again this dialog box shown inside the eps format similarly to ai format so you can select the illustrator 10 i mostly prefer illustrator 10 eps you can save as illustrator 20 eps as well according to your <coughs> use okay now hit okay the file is saved now go to my folder the eps is also saved now the here is the third <clears throat> file type third file type is the pdf file type so go to again my file save as and hit o pdf file okay now i change the name of the file to pdf type so most most of the people ask uh, uh, sir <clears throat> where we can use pdf file you can use pdf file on print media now on or also on social media if you want to share your design with another person then you must save your file in pdf uh, you uh, you cannot 
you must not send the file in directly in AI format or EPS format. Uh, <coughs> you must save the file in PDF format so the user cannot edit the file. You he can only see or review the file. Okay, the, the default setting is the best option to save the PDF file. This is best for print media, even sharing with people as well. So hit OK save. Now the PDF file is also saved. You can see that I simply double click it. Uh, I use the converter.nitro PDF Nitro. You can you have uh, Adobe uh, Reader also where your design is shown. This is the or this is our design. You can see that all in the form of vector base. You can see that. Okay. <clears throat> now go to the next file type which is SVG. SVG is most commonly used or most popular in uh, website designing as well or even you can upload SVG file on different platforms like uh, Adobe Stock uh, even on Vectize you can upload SVG file directly through your browser okay and now I go to save as and then select the option SVG and then I change my file name as SVG file. Okay, and hit okay. There is a dialog box open. You must uh, save or make a screenshot of that of these options that I already selected. SVG 1.1 type is SVG. Uh, submit sub setting is none embedded ah, there is a important part css properties you must select presentation attribute this is a one-time selection and uh, next time you open your or uh, you save your file in svg this setting is already selected you must select svg properties as presentation attributes because the websites must uh, um, the website have say, said that you must have CSS property as presentation attribute the remaining setting as default and hit OK now you can see the SVG file is also created let's open it okay you can see that this is the SVG file you can use on your website uh, your uh, a stock foot of a website even your uh, coding uh, related website okay now is the different file type is the psd file type you can save your illustrator file as a psd directly from adobe illustrator as well for that purpose you go to file go to export now here is the difference between save as and export as for, from save as you can save your file in uh, AI, PSD, EPS, and SVG, and PDF format. For saving your PSD file, or for saving your PNG, or AutoCAD, or JPG, you must go to File, and then Export, and Export As. You must remember this setting. Okay, now go to the PSD. Here is the PSD format. And I make a name as 2022 poster PSD type. Then export. There is a, an option which is very, very important. You must consider it. Okay, now I have the three options. First is RGB, second is CMYK, and grayscale. For RGB, if you use these posts on social media or selling on website, you can select RGB. If you want to print your file, then select CMYK. I select RGB because I mostly upload these files on stock photography website. So this is very helpful for me. And the next option is the flat image. And with right uh, layers, this option is disabled because in RGB you cannot change the layers. If you select CMYK, then you can change the layers. You can simply simply select the CMYK format and then write layers. In this way, the PDF file having all the all Adobe Illustrator 
layers in PN Photoshop as well. Okay, I select CMYK for the layer making purpose. Okay, now I select hit okay. Okay, go to my folder. This is the PSD file. I simply double click and open the file to show you that all layers are already made by Adobe Illustrator in simple two steps go to file export export as and then select the psd format and and inside that option you must select cmyk and write layers option okay wait for some time wait 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 uh, these are ai eps pdf svg and psd files are uh, already made in this okay i just simply drag uh, the program and paste it in front of you okay <laughs> this is the wrong file we have saved but don't worry the main uh, purpose is our layers that we have already make over layers these are the two layers first is text and second is the rectangle layer okay in this way you can make a psd file in simple two steps with all layers and with all settings as well okay now go to the uh, third last file type which is autocad drawing or w a r d w g file okay now go to again my file go to save export export as then i select the top first option which is w uh, d w g format okay in this way you can save your autocad file directly from illustrator and you can open in a uh, different software which is autocad okay you can save an awd autocad type okay export and then uh, i request the no setting change simply uh, <coughs> remain the setting and hit ok the awg file is made i don't have autocad software uh, so he did not show the icon of autocad if you have autocad software this automatically uh, select the icon just like eps yeah, like illustrator icon as well okay now the uh, second last option is the png format now I go to my file, go to file, export, export as, and select my file as PNG. Where is the PNG? There is the PNG. <clears throat> Save as PNG and hit OK. Now again, you can select uh, the higher setting as well. Uh, if you want high resolution, then select 300. If you have <laughs> if you send these posts on social media then you can select 150 ppa as well i select 300 and typically type is i think so <clears throat> type optimize is the best option and here is the option called background color which is the main part of i discuss with you because most of the people say that sir i did not move my background in illustrator while saving png you must select the option called transparent then hit ok in this way you can save your png file without background if you don't select a background uh, option background color option then illustrator automatically save png file with white background or black background okay wait for the file uh, my software is hang so wait for few seconds <clears throat> okay now i hope this file is made okay this is the png file that i make on inside the adobe illustrator and the last file option is jpg file which you can use also in different websites like file go to file export export as and then select the file type which is jpg okay i again select this change the name as jpg and export and also you can change the setting 
the quality of the file you can select uh, the color mode i mostly select rgb color mode because most of the website asked or said that you must have rgb color in your eps file even your jpg file so i select rgb the quality is uh, five or six point is the better option six point because if you increase the <clears throat> quality of the file the size of the file is also increased uh, it may go go to 100 mb as well most of the time okay now there is an option a compression mode uh, must select standard resolution i mostly <clears throat> select 150 because of the file size issue and third is the again hit ok you can save the file inside the my folder where is my file where is my file there is my file there is a jpg file i make i make uh, inside the illustrator okay now we have eight different types of file using adobe illustrator you can make as well more file types inside the illustrator but these are the most commonly used or most uh, demanding types of <clears throat> file most of the website are okay i hope this video will help a lot uh, next video we discuss another topic another file type or another issue with solution so allah hafiz